In this video, I will show you the first steps that you need to take in order to start playing Decentraland. The first thing you need to do is come over to Decentraland.org and this is the main website of Decentraland. Once you are here, click get started and it's going to ask you to either play as guest or play using your wallet. To get the full Decentraland experience, I would highly recommend setting up a wallet so you can click play using your wallet and then you have three options. Metamask is the wallet that I always recommend as it is far easier to integrate with any game. So click Metamask and it will take you over to the Metamask website. Once you are here, select the browser that you are on and click install Metamask and then add it to your browser. It should pop up up here, so click on Metamask and it will take you to a screen that looks like this. Click get started and you have two options. If you have never used Metamask before, you will want to go for the yes, let's get set up. Once here, make sure that you agree and then set a password for Metamask. Once you've done this, click create and you will get brought to this video. This video is going to talk about your 12 word recovery phrase. So if you have never used one before or you don't know what one is, I would highly recommend watching this video. Then you can move on to the next step and here you can actually reveal your security phrase. Then you can confirm your recovery phrase. Once you have done this, click continue and you have set up your MetaMask account. Now your wallet will look like this. Come back over to Decentraland, refresh and then click play using your wallet. Now it will pop up asking you to connect Metamask. Click next, next again and go through all of these steps. And once this is done, you will start signing in to Decentraland. Here you can customize your character. You can choose different hair, different clothes for your character and basically dress your character in any way you would like. You can also go over to collectibles, click marketplace and it will allow you to buy in-game items known as NFTs. As you can see, all of these in-game items and NFTs are listed and paid for in Mana, which is the cryptocurrency of Decentraland. You can sort these by different rarities, sort them by if they are on the Ethereum or Polygon network, and you will also see the rarity of each item underneath it. Once you have customized your character and you are happy with how they look, click done and now you can name your avatar. It may pop up with this security alert so just press allow access and now you can actually start playing Decentraland. You will start seeing a quick walkthrough like this and if you followed all of the steps in this video you will now be able to play Decentraland. 